This is part of a series of videos on how to navigate the Siemens Store IQ Smart Monitoring app. In this video, you will learn how to use the application configuration feature to change your displayed units of measure in the Citran Store IQ app. The units are displayed on the visualization tabs of each of the assets. To change the units, open the main menu by clicking on the button in the upper left hand corner and then select the application configuration tab. The lower half of this screen shows the defined display measurement settings menu for changing the units of measure. The volume, weight, and distance units are capable of being modified. Each has a drop down showing the standard units that can be displayed. It's important to note that for each of the units, the conversion is based on a standard metric equivalent set in the application. Here, for example, you see that for volume, all modifications are based on the conversion factor from a cubic meter. Let's make a change to the volume units, changing from gallons to cubic meters. As this is a predefined selection, no conversion data is needed. It's automatically filled in. It is worth noting that these are global changes. So any process value throughout your asset hierarchy that's tied to the units in the application configuration will be modified when you make a unit change. To make this change complete, all you need to do is click apply. Now, exit the menu by clicking on the X, and once you refresh your screen, you'll see that the volume is now changed to cubic meters. In addition, if you click on the settings gear in the upper right and select display settings, you'll see that the min, max, high, and low settings have been modified to reflect the new units as well. Now let's go back and see how to use a custom unit of measure. Again, click on the main menu and then the application configuration tab. For this example, we'll convert the distance unit from feet to yards. To do that, you click on the drop down menu. As you can see, yards is not shown. So you will want to select custom. As you can see, a simple conversion table has been opened into editable mode. In the case of yards, insert a conversion factor of 1.094, which is the conversion from meters to yards. Next, enter the unit name as yards. And finally, the unit abbreviation can be set to YD. This is the abbreviation that will be displayed on the visualization tile. Again, you click apply, then you exit the menu by clicking on the X and then refresh your screen. You'll see now that your distance is in the custom unit of yards. Again, it's important to note that making this change will apply the yards unit to all distance visualization tiles in the asset structure. This is how simple it is to change your units in the Citran Store IQ app. On the screen we're showing here, you'll see that there's a gauge with a heading of D2E for days to empty and a unit of measure in days. This is a setting that was made at the time this Store IQ app was custom designed and is not configurable through the application configuration tool. There is one other feature in the main menu that I would like to point out. If you click on the service and support tab, you'll see two key links. The first is the email address for technical support of your Store IQ app. Any questions or major modifications and or additions that you want to make to your Store IQ package can be addressed through this email address. The second is a link to the manual that aids you in your day to day usage of your Store IQ monitoring app. This concludes our video on how to use both your application configuration capability as well as the service and support offering of the Siemens Store IQ Smart Monitoring app. Other videos in the series look at additional key features of the Store IQ in more detail, allowing you to take full advantage of what this powerful tool can offer.